is uh, students on your request i'm going to explain some of the operations that are to be done on this scientific calculator okay first how to fix in this calculator see press the mode for one time you get computational and complex press it once again you get standard deviation regression and base right on the screen press it again you get equation matrices and vector then again degree radiant gradient see here you get fix scientific and normal you want to fix right so go for first option and it is asking you how many decimal places are to be fixed to how many decimal places should i fix say 4 okay that's all so while doing so see one fix appears on the screen fix okay now suppose you want to uh, come out of this uh, mode so what you should do you press shift mode so shift mode it is asking what should i clear memory or mode or all okay to be in the safer side you say all 3 reset all comes press equal to and all cancel that's all everything will get cancelled okay so only d will be there on your screen now let us come to this problem how to solve equations see press mode for one time computational and complex appears once again standard deviation regression and base once again equation matrices and vector see go to that equation mode press 1 now it is asking you the num to type the number of unknowns the number of unknowns here is 2 right so i say 2 it is asking me how many unknowns are there 2 or 3 tell 2 okay now it is asking for the coefficients see a1 is this b1 is this c1 is this and also remember you should have c1 on the right side of the equation not in the left side okay so this is the pattern in which you should give the values a1 is 2 press equal to now it is asking for b1 b1 is 3 press equal to c1 is 5 press equal to okay a2 is 3 equal to b2 is 6 equal to c2 is 9 equal to now it is it has started giving you the answers so write x is equal to 1 again press equal to it will give the answer for y that is also equal to 1 in this case right this is how you should use uh, this calculator to solve the equations yes now that i have finished i should come out of this mode right so press shift mode clear the mode to mode clear equal to ac okay only then you will come out of the equation mode right shift mode ask him to clear the mode equal to ac okay fine now let us consider this problem of finding of adding two fractions and i want the answer in fractions so what should i do see two see there is a key a b by c here right if you press that key you will get a symbol like this a uh, reverted l okay 2 by 3 plus 3 by 8 by i press a b by c okay if i say equal to i am getting a mixed fraction see the answer is 1 1 by 24 i don't want it as a mixed fraction i want a proper fraction so what should i do shift abc gives you the proper fraction okay right again i don't want the answer to be in fraction i want the decimal value so what should you do simply press abc you will get this answer 1.042 okay if you simply press abc you will get the answer in decimals if you get if you press shift again if you press abc it becomes an improper fraction 
shift a b c is going to give you proper fraction press a b c it is going to give you the answer by dividing the numbers okay fine so this is over let us come to this case right see i am going to calculate this value um, now you need not write any steps while calculating these values directly give the answer how to do it see e power x is here outside this ln natural logarithm okay so shift ln displays e on the screen minus you can use this minus also minus 0.5 into see i am writing into into 0.5 power see this hat symbol is used for power 4 divided by 4 factorial see factorial is here outside this key okay so you should use shift x inverse that displays factorial that's all right press equal to you get an answer like this so you get an answer in the exponential form if you ask him to fix to some four or five decimal places he will smoothly give the answer you can take the answer fine okay now let us come to the last issue 4c2 for 0.4 power 2 0.4 power 4 minus 2 4 minus 2 is 2 so i am going to type this directly see your ncr key is here right outside this divide symbol so to call it i should use shift key right 4 shift divide gives c 2 into 0 0.4 power 2 into 0 0.6 power 2 or i can use square anyway right so i get the answer is 0 0.34560 so i am doing it again listen 4 shift divided by give c 2 right it is 6 you know right okay you need not do it like this because you are using scientific calculator you can ask him to do everything directly 0.4 square into 0.6 square right instead if you do it even separately you are going to get the same answer right so try to explore all other key students and try to do calculations smoothly with this scientific calculator okay thank you